finally put the wheels on man I had them for a while they were in the shop and the shop was closed because of this COVID-19 shit and then what happened was I got a flat tire and I wasn't about to buy a new stock tire so I asked them if they could open up and install them real quick finally got them they look great so I got the Jeep SRT wheels okay 20 by 10 and then I got the Nittos I went 295 45 okay so as you could see in the video that I have how they look um, really happy with them just so you guys know I do have my uh, Durango is lowered so if you don't have yours lowered and you got those wheels whatever your gap between there between the wheels and the fender would be a lot more I got the e-box springs and then the Whatever else I needed to uh, take care of the load leveling thing in the back, whatever they were, shocks. <clears throat> I see a lot of people ask questions, how do they lower theirs because of that load leveling thing. Go on ebok.com, get their phone number, call them, they have a kit. Get their springs and get that kit, they'll know exactly what you're talking about. But, I just wanted to post a video real quick, I hope you guys like the wheels. I did a little run around the truck so you could see. Just so you know, the truck drives better with these wheels. They drive better. I didn't want to go 22, okay? I had 22s on my Charger back in 2008, 2009, uh, and, I, and they were low-profile wheels. I didn't want to go that route. Love the, I love the rims, love the tires. Truck drives better. It definitely grips better. Totally happy with it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below and uh that's it quick video today see you guys later